All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to lesson 3.5, mean, median, and mode, found in your textbook on page 108. So, goal for this is to use means, medians, and modes to compare groups of data. Now, what we're going to be doing here today is review. So, if I'm reviewing, you're taking notes. So, copy your title, follow along in the textbook, and write down this for your note taking. All right, so, first of all, in our review, we have the mean. Okay, what is the mean? The mean's an average. All right, so the average, the sum of a set of numbers, and the way we find average is um, take all the numbers, add them up, and divide them by how many. All right, so you have all the numbers here. These are the win totals since 2009 for both the Toronto Blue Jays and the Boston Red Sox. I'm only doing that is because currently they're playing them tonight. Now, when we see this video, hopefully the season's over. It'll be for the Blue Jays anyway. But uh, tonight, the Blue Jays are playing the Red Sox. So, for the, since 2009, the Boston Red Sox have a win total of two, uh, sorry, 440. Blue Jays have a win total of 388 since 2009. Now, what's their average win total per year? All right, so since 2009, we have how many seasons? One, two, three, four, five seasons. So this total gets divided by five. All right, both of these totals get divided by five. So 440, as I bust up my calculator here, 440 divided by five is 88 wins. So on average, since 2009, the Red Sox of Boston have had 88 wins. All right, so that's their average win total per year. Okay. Well, what about your Toronto Blue Jays? Well, obviously it's going to be lower since the total's lower. But how much lower? What? How much better per season have the Boston Red Sox been than the Toronto Blue Jays? And they go 388 divided by five. 77.6 so we'll say on average they have 78 wins per season so you took this total divided by five and that's what you have so 77.6 rounded up to 78 wins all right so they've been on average since 2009 better by 10 wins a season okay that's how you would apply using average. All right, all right, next. And we're gonna keep the Toronto theme going here. All right, the median, the middle value um, in a set of ordered data. So when there's an odd number, the median is the middle number. When there is an even number of numbers, 10, 12, 14, what have you, the mean, the median is the mean of the two middle numbers. Now, first thing you do, here are the win totals for your Toronto Raptors over the past 10 years. First thing you do, okay, your first step is to order these numbers. Order from least to greatest. Now, we have 10 numbers here. So here is your median, these two numbers, 33 and 34. Well, what's the average of these two numbers? 33. So, over the past, so the median of the past 10 years, they have won either half over 33.5 or under. So that has been their median, their middle win total over the past 10 years. Now, take this down, pause it if you need to, to copy this down, take that example down, and understand how I got it. And again, we're going to be reviewing tomorrow. Okay, again with this, pause that, copy it, and there you have your notes. Now, finally, mode. And what better way to show mode than the win totals since 2003 for my San Francisco 49ers. Okay, so 2003, we have a record of 7 and 9, 2 and 14, etc., etc. But what is the mode of these numbers? What is the mode of the win totals? So the win totals we're looking... Okay, left column, 
number that occurs the most often in a set of data, and unfortunately since 2003 has been that great. There can be more than one mode, and there might be no mode. Okay, if they're all the same num, if they're all single numbers, all unique numbers, there's no mode. Okay, this is the number that occurs most often in a set of data. So let's take a look at this data since 2003. We have seven, two, four, seven. Okay, seven's happening again. Five, seven again. Okay, in 2008, eight, six. 13, 11, 12, oh wait, I forgot to put 2014, hold on, 2014, 16, and, oh, okay, beautiful, but still, that doesn't fit with the mode, what we have here, we have 7 happening here, 7 happening here, 7 happening here, 7 happens the most times in the past 10 years. So the mode for this set of numbers, the number that occurs the most often is unfortunately 7. Okay? Now probably over the next few years, 2015, 16, we're going to have more numbers in the high teens and pre probably most likely 16 and 0 for the next several seasons. So go 49ers and go take some good notes. So thank you for watching. It's a short one this time. Just take some good notes. Pause it. Go back to it. Understand it, come prepared with notes, all right? Thanks for watching.